One of the toughest things to deal with when creating videos is background noise, particularly when recording voiceovers like this one. I had instances where it rained so hard, nothing else could be heard from the recording aside from that. But hopefully, this tool would make a difference. This is the item. It costs 1,843 Philippine pesos, which is around $37.91 US, including the shipping. It arrived September 15th of 2020. I paid it on the same day because it's cash on delivery. So in total, I waited six calendar days for the package. Now let's get to the unboxing. So the tape, I have to cut it off. Okay, it's easy. Let me just do that for you. I'm confident that I'm not damaging anything. But the plastic sure feels durable. Okay. You just cut all these open. Here it is. Alright. I should say that this is my first time buying something like this, so I'm not really sure what to expect. Alright. Here it is. Ooh. Plastic's out. So the brand is called AQA. Recording screen, five foldable panels. Okay. So I'm getting a good feeling so far. Is this the box? All right. So it can be used on a desktop. It could be used with a floor stand. I wonder if it comes with a floor stand. Uh-huh. So microphone and shock amounts are not included. Angle adjustable, power buckle screw, portable, collapsible. So far, it looks like what I've seen on the advertisement. Okay. Absorption layer, filter layer, emission layer. Huh. Alright, so let's take it out of the box. I want to see what's inside, so let's open it. Uh -huh. Everything feels sturdy so far like it's what you'd expect from a price point like this so this is what it, oops hold on camera haha <laughs> so this is what it looks like without me touching anything yet once i opened it I'm, i assume this is the bottom part so let me slowly take it out oh the inside feels warm okay maybe this way hold on carefully and gently with the plastic still on. Alright. This seems to be everything that's inside. It has plastic. Okay. Let me just get that into focus. Ah, I'm so sorry, guys. My lighting. Alright. So, let me just take that out of the plastic. And, oops. What was that? Hold on, what else is inside? So, screws, what is this? Some screws, uh-huh. All right, I'll figure out what this is later on. Oops. All right, so this part seems to be made of plastic. Let me try to give you a closer shot using my macro lenses later. And I'm opening this up. It has five panels. Look at that. So there it is. The branding front and center. And then when I turn it the other way around. Hold on. Carefully. Not really working with a lot of space here. This is what it looks like. So it's a lot of acoustic panels. Now for the close-up shots. So this is a close-up shot of the foam. Okay. And this is an unstable close-up shot of that plastic rear. Okay, there you are. Now for the review. To make it more interesting, I'm going to introduce a bit more noise by turning on my fan. It's an industrial fan. I'll turn it on to the highest setting as well as my air conditioning unit so that it would produce 
background noise. Hold on. For the worst possible scenario, this is how it sounds like without a microphone and both my fan and the air conditioning units are turned onto their highest settings and on top of that, I'm not using the noise isolation panels. For the second worst scenario, this is how it sounds like without me using a microphone. The fan and my air conditioning units are turned onto their highest settings, but I am facing the noise isolation panels. For the second best scenario, I am now using a microphone. My fan and air conditioning units are turned on to their highest setting, but I'm not using the noise isolation panel, and this closely resembles my current setup. For the best scenario, this is how it sounds like when I'm using my microphone. The fan and my air conditioning unit is on to their highest settings, and I'm also facing the noise isolation panels. To make sure that I'm being thorough, I would also give you a sample of how my vlogging setup moving forward would be. So here I am using my microphone. The fan is off. My air conditioning unit is turned on to its lowest setting. I can't completely turn it off for obvious reasons because I wouldn't be comfortable. And of course, let's not forget that I would also have this noise isolation panel. So this is what you could expect of my audio quality moving forward. My biggest takeaway from this experience is that tools such as microphones, noise isolation panels, or recording screens, whatever you may call them, they could only do so much. There is no substitute for physically removing background noises, such as the simple acts of turning a fan off if you don't really need it. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and let me know what you think in the comments. Also, if you're interested in seeing more content like this, make sure to hit that subscribe button as well as that notification bell so you're always updated whenever I upload new content. Thanks for watching and have a great day.